Hello friends, welcome to AutoCAD video tutorials. I am Prabhu and you are watching this video from cybercadsolutions.com. Today in this session, I am going to explain how to draw a polygon in AutoCAD. There are three different methods to draw a polygon in AutoCAD. The first one is inscribed in circle, second one is circumscribed about circle and the third one is using edge method. In the both first method and second method, we have to provide center point and radius so that a polygon will a polygon will be created either inside a circle or about a circle. So to use a toolbar, we have to go over here in the draw group and click and take the second button. This tool button we have to click. If you place your cursor over that polygon tool button, you can observe two different options being shown in the tool tip. The first one is uh, inscribed circle. The second one is circumscribed about a circle. Let us try how to use these two options. The shortcut command for polygon is pol. Type pol at the command prompt and press enter. Now it is asking to enter the number of sides at command prompt. Already it is there. It is the default value is not the default value, current value is 5. I would like to go with the same value, say 5 and press enter. Now it is asking to specify the center point of polygon. I am just clicking over here on the screen like this. And now we have got two different options, inscribed in circle, circumscribed about circle. Let us go with the first option. We know that to activate this option, we have to click on this option. I am clicking on inscribed in circle. Now you can observe the prompt change it to specify radius of circle. So it is asking to specify the radius or pk point so that the distance between those two points will be read as radius. So I am typing 5 as radius and press enter. You can see a polygon has been created. But if you try to measure the distance between two points, that is from this point on this point or uh, if you find the distance, I mean if you find the length of a side we will know what is the radius of the circle. So to find the distance between two points, we have a command called DIST. Type DIST at the command prompt and it will ask to specify first point. I am clicking over here. Now it is asking to specify second point. I am clicking again over here. Now you can see the distance or the length of one side is 5.8779. So whatever the radius we have provided is not used for the length of a side. So this method is not useful for us. Let us go with the second method. Again type pol at the command prompt and it is asking to enter number of sides. Already previously used 5 value is shown here as current value. You can press enter to accept the same value. I am pressing enter. Now it is asking to specify center of polygon. I am clicking over here. Now we have got two options, inscribed in circle, circumscribed about circle. We have already used the first one. We will go with second one that is circumscribed about circle. I am clicking this option, circumscribed about circle. Now again we got the command prompt, specify radius of circle. Again I am typing 5 at the command prompt as radius and pressing enter. Now you can see a polygon is created. Try to find the length of one side so that we can understand what is this radius of circle. Again use DIST command. Type DIST and press enter. Pick two points. From here to here I want to measure. So it is 7.2654 which is not our requirement. So how to draw a polygon with required length of one edge side. So I am erasing these two polygons. Let us try the third method. Again type POL at command prompt and enter the number of sides. I am pressing enter to accept 5 value and it is asking to specify center of polygon. At this point of time, if you observe at the command prompt, it is asking, it is showing one option edge in square brackets. We have to take this option. So we can type E at the command prompt to take this option or click on this. I am typing E and press enter. Now it is asking to specify first end point of edge. Let us click over here on the screen. Now it is asking to specify second point of edge and I am dragging my cursor like this and entering the length of the side. 
using direct distance method just simply type the length of one side five units and press enter now if you measure the length of one side using dist command from here to here it is exactly five units so this method is useful for us to draw a polygon with the required length of edge these are the three different methods available in autocad to draw a polygon hope you understood this method if you like this video please share my video link from cybercad solutions to your friends and if you have any doubts please email me to cybercadprabhu@gmail.com thanks for watching this video and welcome to the next session